on tonight's Turning Point, we look at a memorable home run. Tom Lawless talked about it recently at a night to honor the 1980 Cardinals. What made it so memorable was he only had one big league homer before that swing, but acted like he'd done it many times before. Tom Lawless gets the start at third. Tom Lawless. Terry hurt himself swinging in batting practice, Pendleton, and he couldn't, uh, he couldn't swing on the right side. I got the opportunity to play, you know, against the left-handed starter, which was Frank Viola. First and third, nobody out. I just screwed it up by not putting the bun on. You know, there's two outs, and I'm looking for the bun side, and he didn't put the bun on, so I figured, well, I better hit. The pitch. Swing and a high fly ball to left. That was the front row of right behind home plate, and I thought, you better get all of it. Way back at the track. It's a three-run home run. The famous backflip that has been rated as one of the best, back, maybe the first backflip ever. He flipped the bat like in his <laughs> gun, and it hit the back of the wall. And it went over by three feet, by the way. That is hard to imagine. Luckily, it went out because he was ready for me at all the way. And I told him, boy, you lucky. <laughs> <laughs> I've coached baseball, I've managed baseball in the minor leagues and, and even in the big league for a little bit. And that's what I tell all the kids. When you walk off the home plate, you have a chance. You have a bat in your hand, you have a chance. To hit one is a big deal, <laughs> especially in the World Series. And against Frank Viola, for yes. heaven's sakes. And when you think about it, that's one of the 10 most memorable home runs for in Cardinals sure, history. Because it was so yeah. unexpected. And he just played the part so cool. I mean, it was just. It's one of those things that if you're a Cardinals fan, you will never forget. Absolutely. And we'll be right back.